All right, everybody, good late morning. The pick is in for the Seahawks at 136, the top pick of the fifth round now, pick number 136. There continues to be some very intriguing stuff here available. Ban Pran remains on the board somehow. Can't really figure out how that worked out. Uh, still have Jeremiah Trotter Jr. here. Still waiting on them to get back from commercial so we can actually see what the pick is. But um, there's a lot that I did not think was going to be here at all now that we've gotten to the fifth round. you got Christian Mahogany. You've got Malik Washington. You've got Chris Abrams Drain if you want to go cornerback. Nehemiah Pritchett was one of my sleepers. Jerry Rice's kid. JV on Cohen. Josh Newton. Um, I'm going to definitely have an open mind here. If you want to go James Williams and have like a hybrid safety linebacker, I think that would appeal to a lot of people, especially at this point in the draft. I don't think anybody would mind that. Ulo Foshio at linebacker, keep him in the state of Washington. Um, there, There's just, a, I got a whole page worth of prospects in my notes, a whole page worth worth of prospects in my notes that I would consider to be good or better value at this point in the draft. Still in commercial, still waiting for official announcement here. And ESPN skipped our pick. They did it again. They did it again. ESPN completely passed over our pick to show a pizza commercial. Awesome. So we're going to have to go to the website and take a look and see what we actually did. And, um, Nehemiah Pritchett, Nehemiah Pritchett, one of my top sleepers at the cornerback position. He was a guy that I liked a lot more than most people. I had a late third round grade on him, early fourth, late third, getting him at the top of the fifth round. I love it. I absolutely love it. I know cornerback was not considered a huge need for this Seahawks team. I know that... My perception of him was a lot more positive than a lot of people, but he really stood out to me as somebody who I thought would fit well in McDonald's defense and I thought would just be, in general, a good NFL player. Um, shame on you, ESPN, for not putting that on TV, but I really like this pick, guys. He's one of my top sleepers in this draft, and to get him all the way in the fifth round to me is a big-time, big-time coup. So, Nehemiah Pritchett of Auburn is the pick. I love it. He was very, very close to being promoted to my on-screen big board here. He was just like one or two picks away. And I am pretty amped up on this one personally. So, uh, I, I know that this is not a player that every Seahawks fan is going to rally around because I know he's not some super high-profile player. But I'm a big fan of this one. I love it. I love the value. I love the approach. And I'm excited to see what he brings to the table to the Seahawks team in 2024. All right, I'm going to get this video up. And then we're chilling until uh, the sixth round here. We're chilling for a while. So, uh, so far, pretty good day, day three. It's not exactly what I would have done, but this Pritchett pick, I'm big into. All right, see you guys later. Go Hawks. That might be my favorite pick of the draft from a pure value standpoint.